Oh yeah, it's going to be hot today. But you know what? Here, let's let's throw some some positive spin on this. Uh, we've been through a couple big heat waves where we were hitting 105, 106. We're breaking records, and this is technically a heat wave because we're we're seeing a spike in the temperatures over the next couple of days. But generally below 100. Uh, not as hot as the other ones, and it's only going to be for two more days, and then we're off uh, and running into a great weekend ahead and a big cool down by Friday. So just hang on. We'll go ahead and take you through everything so you don't have to uh, pay attention and remember everything. Uh, we've got uh, hot weather today and tomorrow. It will be windy by the end of the week. There is a fire risk. Uh, we've got to pay attention to that. Remember, everything's dry already and ready to go. We have a big fire near the Getty Center in L.A. at the moment. So just know that once the wind shows up, there is a fire risk, even if the temperatures are coming down. Great Great shot there from Sharon Givens. Remember, you can always send photos to weatherforce at abc10.com or our ABC10 app in the weather section. It's right there. You can just upload the photo and it gets right to me. 50s and 60s down low, 30s up high. So where does this uh, stand? You know, yesterday is above average, but not record breaking. Today, we get a little closer to the records, but I don't think that we're going to get there. I think mostly what we're looking at is a nice morning. A nice early afternoon, although warm and warmer than yesterday. But once you get past 1, 2 o'clock, it starts to become just too, too warm slash hot to do much. So we're looking at highs in the upper 90s. The bottom of your screen there for the Gilmore Backyard, you can see that the wind will be up a little bit. 5 to 10 miles per hour, but not necessarily windy. I would call it slightly breezy. Uh, what we're going to see is a big change. This is what this will look like. Going forward, high pressure is going to hang on two more days, so plan on the hot weather in the afternoon, but still nice mornings. And then out to sea, you see a big area of low pressure. This is a big boy. Knock that puny little high out of here, and that means a drastic cool down within one day. 15 degree temperature cooling but and a lot of wind as well. I'm going to show you the rain here because there is one additional thing. There's just so much to this area of low pressure that by Friday night and Saturday we're going to looking at the occasional light rain shower in the mountains. I don't think we're getting snow with this but I do think a little rain in the mountains is probably going to happen uh, either on Friday or Saturday or both days. So that's another thing that we're paying attention to. Here's the numbers 90s today and tomorrow then 80s for Friday with a lot of wind.